Brain Honey is a valuable tool for designing customized and personalized content aligned to specific standards. The real-time visual data within Brain Honey aids teachers in developing learning experiences to meet the needs of all students. Let's take a look at what this application looks like. And as we do, imagine how Brain Honey will fit into your own classroom. We'll look at the course navigation, homepage dashboard, building content, and the gradebook. First, let's take a look at how content is organized in Brain Honey. Brain Honey is comfortably organized, much like other popular systems, into sets of folders that contain content. Students and teachers find this very easy to navigate. It allows students to see where they are as it tracks their progress through the content and activities. It allows them to easily pick up where they left off when they visit the page again. It even shows them how they did on a given activity. But what really makes Brain Honey stand out from other systems is what happens under the hood. So let's take a look. When you log in, the first thing you will see is the home page dashboard. The data on the home page provides you with an at a glance view of key information from the courses you are teaching, including the to do list, which shows the items needed in grading or other attention. The summary chart allows you to show how well your students are doing and progressing through the course as well as a summary of your responsiveness in grading assignments, posts, and exams. The courses window shows each of your courses, the number of students, as well as visual feedback on your responsiveness, student performance, and student pace. And the critical students window flags students that are performing below expectations in either performance and or pace. So as you can see, you can use the homepage dashboard to maintain a higher level view of what is going on in your classes. Now, let's take a look at what it's like to build content in Brain Honey. When building course content, you will select edit mode. In edit mode, you can add modules, lessons, and folders, which can house different course resources and activities. Once resources are added to the course, they can be moved around by dragging and dropping them into desired sequencing. Teachers can design lessons and activities that suit the needs of each student by connecting them with objectives and standards and tracking their progress. The way that Brain Honey integrates standards and objectives into edit mode is very helpful to the lesson planning process. Objectives can be attached to modules as a whole and can be added to specific objects as well to target each individual objective. In order to utilize this feature, you'll first need to add the objectives that you want to the left-hand column. You can do this by clicking on Edit and Import Objectives. You can then search for the Michigan Merit Curriculum or Common Core Standards that apply to your lesson. If you need to add additional standards that are not part of the Michigan Merit or Common Core, you can choose Add to enter them manually, or you can import them from a CSV file as well. Once you are all set with the objectives that you want, click OK. You will then notice that your objectives now appear on the left. You can now drag and drop standards into a module, assign them to content and assessments, and you can even assign them to specific questions within assessments. In terms of searching for content, MyBlend has licensed content to search and add to courses. You can search for resources that are aligned to standards and or keyword. You can preview content before you add it. And if you decide that you want to use any content items, simply drag and drop them to the module sequence. So you can see that building and finding content in Brain Honey can be easily aligned to content objectives and flexibly sequenced. Lastly, let's take a brief look at the Brain Honey gradebook. Gradebook provides a rich set of tools for easily grading student assignments and exams, providing feedback, and reviewing grades. You can select an individual student to get an overview of the content they have been through. Here you can see how they are doing and when items were turned in along with their due dates. By selecting the activity icon, you can view granular detail of the student's activity in the course and the amount of time they have spent on specific items within the course. Selecting the Learning Objective Mastery icon allows you to see which objectives have been mastered to date by that student. Mastery is determined by the student's responses on assessments, student grades on assignments, and the mastery threshold which was specified when the course was created. 
You can also look at the overall class performance by selecting the Objectives link in the course menu to see the percentage of students who have mastered the objective. All these views of grades and analytics in BrainHoney give both high level and minute level detail into where your students are at and how they are doing so that every student's needs can be accommodated. As shown here, BrainHoney is a state-of-the-art application to help you provide customized and personalized learning experiences for your students. This video gave you a brief glimpse into how BrainHoney is designed with advanced course authoring, learning objective management, gradebook management, and student tools to make this learning experience possible.